what's up, yeah, what's going on? What's going on, sports net? Earl Thomas, who hasn't played football since 2019. Since the Baltimore Ravens cut him. Because uh, he had some incidents with the Baltimore Ravens. And he had incidents with his wife. So 2022, he's talking about making a comeback. Here's the problem. His head ain't right. His head's not right. He, must, he probably suffering from some early signs of CTE. Anger management. Now when you're young, growing up in Texas, being physical on the football field is a plus. Being a little different is a benefit. It helps you out. Now the Texas legend was a great football football player in Texas and a great Seattle Seahawk. But once he left Seattle, things been been going south for him. Him and his wife, they're on the verge of getting a divorce. A lot of issues. A lot of issues off the field. So he he announces that uh Alright, I'm straight. I need to make I'm about ready to make a comeback. Then I read about he violated two or three protective orders. Texan and I got two new brand new handguns. Threatening a woman and children. More than likely his wife and kids. Earl Thomas is not ready to make a comeback. Earl Thomas need to get his head checked. He need to see some people. Here's another thing. Earl, Earl Thomas, if you watch this corner sports net video, Earl, you're not, you're not playing no more football. Your career is over. NFL team's not gonna touch you. They look at your little rap sheet. It's not gonna happen. But you do need to get help. Immediately. Like I said, on the football field, organized violence is acceptable. Teams love it. But when that translates into your personal life, you're gonna have problems. A lot of guys can't turn it off. Earl Thomas is one of them guys who can't turn it off. So he needs to get help. Stop talking about you making a comeback. Your personal life is chaos. Now I hope you get yourself together. But please, stop talking about a comeback. Get your head checked out. Get your personal life in order.